everybody. This is Cindy Utter. Welcome to my Artsy Endeavors. Have fun. Hey guys, Cindy Otto here with my Artsy Endeavors. Okay, we are going to continue with our May setup. This is for uh, my year. It's under here. Oh, it's this. Um, we've, you saw yesterday me setting up this main page. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to work on the tip-ins. So we're going to do that today. I'm going to set this aside. Now I have this um, on the main page I was working on. <clears throat> setting this up <clears throat> pardon me um, I actually have this uh, piece of watercolor paper that I pulled out of the just the, the scraps that I have here and what I'm gonna do is I'm just scoring it because I want it to fold Now I want it to fold, but I'm not exactly sure. Let's see how I'm going to tip it in. We're going to do it this way, I think. All right, so what we need to do, let's get some color on this. Let's see. Let me grab my colors and I'll be right back. All right, so I have a few different kinds of um, paint here. I've got Waverly um, from Plaid. This is a high performance semi gloss acrylic paint. I have Buttercream from Decor, soft gloss, high performance. And then I have Handmade Modern. These are from Target. I have Satin and I have Neon. So these colors right here make me think of spring. So what I'm going to do is we're just going to get some sponges out and we're going to play and get some color on this bad boy. And I'm going to fast forward through the process. Okay, so I've just kind of put some paint down here, which it's all good. Now you can see here where I use this as a wipe off of my flowers. That's fine. Um, I do have this flower stamp. This is from Unity um, for a while I was getting their uh, monthly, I can't remember which stamp set it was, but every month I got a big sheet of stamps. And I really like their stamps. I like the fact that um, some of them are really big, which like this one is. So what I'm going to do... I just want to use this stamp. All right, let's see what's going on here. Move this crap out of my way so I can actually do it. Um, and I'm just going to keep stamping this the whole way down. 
Now it doesn't matter that it's brighter on one side than the other. I'm actually going to continue. Well, let's see, put you here, you here. I mean, what a great background stamp this is. Isn't that fantastic? Look at that. So pretty. All right, I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. And sorry about my squeaky chair. Someday I will get a new one. If you have any recommendations on a chair that works well with back injuries, please let me know. <laughs> I'm open to suggestions. I'm going to turn it over. I'm going to keep doing the same thing. How pretty is that? Isn't that cool? Okay. Now, what am I going to do with my tip-in? Let's figure it out. I'll be right back. Okay, guys. So what I did, um, these came out of a uh, Flow magazine. Um, it was one of the ones that was for paper lovers. I usually pick these up when I can just because I enjoy the paper. I like the paper. So what I'm going to do, um, I just folded these in half. That's the way I found them in my stash. I want to, I really love this background, but I really want to make it um, so that I can journal in it throughout this month. So I've got some, um, these are called Edge Craft. They're just those scissors that make the funky, the, um, the funky edges. So I have a whole bunch of them. And I picked out this pair. Some, you know, sometimes I love these, other, these scissors. Other times I love to hate these scissors because they just won't cut the way I want them to. So what I'm going to do is I am just going to put a little border. It doesn't, I'm not worried about it. I don't care if it's straight or not. Um, I just want a little border on these cards and actually I want to cut it about here and I'm going to cut it about here see how I measure about here and about here and about there <laughs> and it's cockeyed I can see that see how cockeyed it is so I will try to straighten it up just a little bit. All right. Now I have got two pieces. And I think this other one I'm going to do is this mint green. I like the mint green. Or do I want to do the pink? I like the mint green. So let's do the mint green. Let's grab a different type of scissor. Uh, no, 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 no. No, no. Let's see what we can find here. That one looks kind of cool. No. Alright, so we're going to use this one. And then I'm going to cut it about here. Now these cut really nice compared to the other ones I just had out. Is it because of the um, pattern? I don't know. I just know they cut nice. Do, 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 do. Alright, so I'm going to put these on the front. I've got one for the back. And I only need one more, which is here. So I'm going to use another one of these, only I'm going to use this this time. Let's just get this off. Do, do, do. 
Cubs and I were out setting up the RV last night. That was really fun. Um, it's just fun getting that stuff together. All right, now I'm going to tape these. I'm not going to glue them. I think I'm going to glue them down um, because I really want them to stay. Not that taping wouldn't make them stay as well, but let's glue them. go and we'll glue this one down I love these colors these colors are just so pretty together okay so there's two this is gonna end up being stuck to the book there's two and we're gonna do these three One. Here's two. And here's three. Perfect. Okay. And that's got some black ink on it. That's all right. All right, so now I want to find uh, some stickers because I really want to make this um, tip in a little bit more decorative. So let me find some stickers and I'll be right back. Okay, so we've got the paper on here. Now what I'm gonna do is I've got this stamp here. Um, it was actually a long one, but I was, I don't know why I cut it in half because I was using it in my travel journal or something. So I just want to put, I'm not looking for perfection again. I just want to put some type of a little background on here because um, I already had ink on this piece of paper. So I figured let's make it more inky. There we go. All right, and what I want to do is I found this little die cut and I just thought it was really pretty. So I'm going to put this on there. I am going to use this glue again. Whoops, wrong way. Only this time I'm going to glue the die cut. And this is going to go right here because this is going to be the first thing that I see when I open the page because this is going to actually tip out. So. We're going to put that there. I think it's cute. Like I said, May, May brings flowers. It brings um, our robins back. It brings all kinds of cool stuff. All right, now I have these four. Um, I think on this blue one, I have this um, butterfly that I had played around with. If I can... Let's bend it. Bend. I want to put it right here. So let's go ahead and we're going to put this on. And where do I have it bent? Right there. Not too high. That works. okay. It's okay. It's all right that its wing sticks up. It's all good. Now I also have these really cool little stamps that were, I'm sorry, um, stickers that were sent to me in a happy mail. So I am going to use these in here. I thought they were very pretty. Um, let me see, I've got two in the front. Let's put this one here. How cool is that? Is it cockeyed? Yep. I don't mind. Let's put this one. I'm going to set that one right here. Aren't they pretty? They're so pretty. And I wish I could remember who sent these to me. I'm 
want to say it, maybe it was Lindy, but I'm not positive. Whoops. I just know they're beautiful, beautiful, beautiful stickers. All right, so now we have a great little journaling book, okay, that we're going to put in our May. Think spring and tip it in. All right, so let's grab our book again. Get some of this junk out of my way. Here's our book. This book is going to be so thick when I'm done with it. Love it! Love it! Alright, so here's our May. Um, I may end up doing some journaling in here just because I can. I have a lot of cool spots for it. Now, this is going to be our tip-in. How come my feathers or my wings not staying down? It's going to be one of our tip-ins. Alright, so... This is going to go on one of these pages. Let me go right here. All right, so before I do that, though, um, I want to... There's a couple things I want to do, really. Let me think about this for a minute. All right, guys, so what I'm going to do um, is we've made the tip-in. Uh, so we're just going to have... Um, this is my tip-in that I'm going to be using in my My Year 2017 this week. So I hope you guys enjoy. I hope you um, decide to make yourself a tip-in. It's really cool. It's a lot of fun to do. And uh, I will see you again tomorrow. Tomorrow we're going to do a real quick lesson. Um, and that is going to be, it's going to be fun. So I hope you guys will join me tomorrow and have a great day. Have fun. That's what life's all about. We'll chat soon. Bye. Hey everybody, I hope you enjoyed that video. As always, hit like, share, comment. I'll answer any of the comments that you have or questions. Um, and as always, be kind, have fun, that's what life's all about, and happy creating. We'll talk to you soon. Bye!